Previously on The Walking Dead. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. I only need a minute. Should have put you out of your misery right then. When I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. Broken people get reckless. Here. Thanks. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. Everybody be cool. in the leg, but uh, I think it went straight through. Shit, I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna be fine. But only be fine. that for a while, I'll take care of it. And if you can't do it anymore. Yeah, that was the end, was the end. You get out here, or I put a bullet in this kid's hand. Shut up! Отпусти меня, прошу. Ты должен быть с ним. Я мажор. Leave him alone, Kenny. He's just a kid. No. No. I'm ending this. Get out here right fucking now. Ты замочил Наташу. Ты ублюдок. Он и так покойник. Ты ему только поможешь. Get out here. Перестань, отпусти меня. Я должен посмотреть, если здесь все в порядке. Stop squirming, damn it. Give me like that. You literally set me up. She came back. <laughs> it's safe to come out. Here, I got him.
Jesus Christ. That was, uh... That was intense. I thought... Eh, I thought that was it. Yeah, it was for these assholes. Are you... Are you okay? I, I think so. I didn't know this man. I never killed someone that didn't wrong me in some way. That didn't deserve it. Tried to pretend he was a walker. But it's different. I didn't think it would be. He deserved it. He was trying to kill us. Yeah. That's why I did it, but... It felt wrong. You can still leave, you know. There's nothing holding you here. I sort of wish that was true. <laughs> Let's go. He's mad. Who, me or Jane? <laughs> she turned. Just like that. Clem spotted it first. Did what she had to to protect the child. This isn't your fault, okay? She just... She just lost too much blood. It ain't nobody's fault. You saved the boy's life. You know, we could have done better by her. She was just too far gone. We should probably go. Don't worry, Becca. We'll take care of your boy. You <sighs> rest easy. <gasps> you oh, piece he's still of alive? Shit. Hey, hey! No way. Stop! Guys! Get guys, off me! Come on! It's over, man. He ain't a threat to us. How can you say that? Of course he is! Get out of the way! Whoa! What are you doing? I'm doing the same thing this asshole tried to do to us! Exactly. It doesn't have to go down like that! Kenny, please! He's just a scared kid, no. man! Move out of the way, Mike! You... Clem, you, you don't mean that! Is it his house? Food! Please! Please, I can take you! Bullshit! No, no! It's true! We have place! Not far! For food! See? He wants to help! Oh, don't no. be stupid! <laughs> He's just trying to save his skin! Why the hell would you help us, huh? I... I now want to see more people dead. Then close your eyes and I'll make it quick. Kenny, back off. If he's telling the truth, it could save all of us. And if it's a trap, we'll all be dead. We need the food. None of this will matter if we all starve to death. She's right, Kenny. We're running low on supplies as it is. It's worth the risk to check this place out. Trust him, don't trust him. It doesn't matter. We should go anyway. We just need to be careful. It can't be far from here. You stay out of this! You're the reason these fuckers came after us in the first place! Don't try and pin this on me. Lay off, Kenny. She just helped us. Look, don't start, all right? I'm sure you're real excited to have your girlfriend back. Mm. Think about the baby, <laughs> Kenny. If there are supplies, we need them. We ain't gonna last much longer without more food. We gotta take a chance. Unless someone's got a better plan. We got something to tie this shit bird up? Yeah, I got something. Follow me, I thank you. Just give me a reason. Yeah, man, he gets it. Look, I know you're probably pissed about me leaving. When I heard the gunshots, I... I knew it was a mistake. If it helps, the thing I'd normally do is walk away for good. But I didn't. Despite what my instincts are telling me. Despite everything I've seen. Everything I've been through. So, you want a cookie? You want a cookie for doing the right thing? <laughs> if you have one, I'll take it. What I'm saying is, I'm here to try to make this work. If I get a cookie for that, then awesome. All I can do is promise you I won't abandon you again. Which, to be fair, mm. I've never done before. Even though I probably should have. A few times now. You don't gotta point the gun at him the whole time. You forget what we just went through? He ain't going anywhere, Kenny. 
No need to get your arm all sore. I'm worried about Kenny. He's... he's in a dark place. We gotta keep an eye on him. Everything he's been through. That he's lost. It's changing him. Yeah, I've noticed that too. You're the only one that he trusts. That he really trusts. Not completely. That means you're the one that's gonna have to pull him back. He's counting on you. If we're really going to make this work, we're all counting on you. It might be too late. I'm afraid of that too. But we still have to try. At least then we'll know for sure. Come on, slow pokes. No, no, I'm I'm fine. Hey, I just need a second. Sorry, I just I just put more weight on it than I should have. All right, wait there. Hey, what I say? When I tell you something, you fucking listen. You understand? Can come on. There's no need <laughs> for that. He's getting what he deserves. I'm fucking talking to you. I say stop. You'd best stop. If you know what's good for you. He deserves it. He deserves to be treated like a human being. That's all I'm saying. After what he did, what happened back there was his fault. He lost all his people in one fell swoop. Ain't much we could do to him that'd be worse than that. Kenny, please, ease up on him. Just fucking stay put. I'm gonna have a word with Kenny. He doesn't have to treat him that way. Kid's been through enough. You all right here? Yeah, yeah. Uh, go on and talk to him. I got clam if I need anything. Okay. Here, just take the baby. Okay. What is it with you guys? What do you mean? Every man I've known is always trying to let each other know how tough they are. Put them in their place. Bunch of dominant alpha male horse shit. <laughs> and it all ends the same way. But don't look at me. I ain't that guy. Oh, that ain't true. You get in your fair share of pissing matches, too. Do I? Are you kidding me? Yes. I guess I should work on that. Guess it took a woman to talk some sense into him. Looks like Jane broke it up. Keep pressure on it, okay? I'm gonna go fetch some bandages. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah? I'm sorry. For what? I'll be right back. We walked. <laughs> At least most of us did. You basically had to be carried. Sitting in the snow. Lean up against a tree. Bullet in my leg. But alive. <laughs> when so many of my friends are dead. For no good reason. And I couldn't do anything to stop it. Everyone we set out with just gone. Nick, Pete, Alvin and Becca. Carlos, Sarah, right and for what? They don't make any sense. They didn't die in vain. I wish I could believe that. I could have done more, and that ain't up for debate. I know it in my bones, and I gotta live with it. All right, this should work. That's perfect. 
What I miss? Hmm? Uh, nothing much. You know, complaining mostly. Trying to guess how far this place is. I'd like to get off this lake sooner than later. Well, that'll have to wait a bit. I'm fine. Hey, Clem. Go over and see if you can change the bandages on Kenny's wound. I offered, but I don't think he was comfortable with me doing it. But you know him better than I do. Maybe he'll let you do it. I don't know if he'll let me. He may not, but you ought to try. That's gonna sting, but only for a second. It's gonna clean it. Oh, I know what it does. It's gonna suck. It's gotta get done. I was thinking we'd go with Alvin Jr. What do you think? Rebecca mentioned she'd like to name him Alvin if it was a boy. I mean, Rebecca was so out of it she hadn't settled on her name. It seems fitting. <laughs> Alvin yeah. Jr. it is. Do you like that? Well, I think AJ approves. What do you uh, got there? Because I think I'm all right. I mentioned it earlier to Bonnie. I'm changing your bandage. Sounds like I don't have much choice in the matter. You don't. You don't. <laughs> you shouldn't have to do stuff like this. Shouldn't have to do a lot of things. All right. Let's get it over with. Hopefully it don't scare this little guy. Or you. Oh, boy. So how's it look? I still gonna be pretty when this heals? I'm glad Carver's dead. We saw to that, didn't we? Ouch. I'm guessing this is going to be the shitty part. <sighs> so this is going to hurt like hell. Well, you could have lied a little, you know. Mm. <sighs> Holy fucking hell. <sighs> you need to stop squirming. Yeah. Yeah, okay. You're right. Sorry about the language, Junior. You're going to be tougher than me when you're grown. I'm going to expect you to be more of a gentleman than I am. Man, is that smart. He can hear a few bad words. I've heard plenty. <laughs> yeah, that shouldn't have been the case. You were right about me giving myself up. I can't believe I was willing to sacrifice Alvin just to hold out a little longer. We should have saved him sooner. Got him out of the camp. I'm gonna think about that every time I look at Alvin Jr. here. Alvin should be here, raising this boy. It should be him, not me. Carver's the one who did it, not you. Yeah, I suppose. But I can't help but feel guilty. Yeah, that looks much better. All done. Thank you, sweetie. Yep. Are we ready to go? Let's head out. Is that it? Hey! 
Hey, I'm talking to you. What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit. Is that <laughs> it? I thought you said it was a house. Arvo, is this where the supplies are? Where the food is? Answer her, goddammit! No, it's at the house. There's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. I think we should spend the night here, if it's safe. That's a big if. <laughs> there's a fence, which would help with walkers. Maybe. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. <laughs> Wouldn't have guessed that it worked. Me neither. I think he <laughs> likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's annoying. Oh, don't be like that. <laughs> He's had a rough start. A real rough start. Here, I got him. Thank you. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Today's my birthday. How do you Here's remember I can tell, that? At least. <laughs> Definitely this week. Well, happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. So, how old are you now? I am 27 years old. Well, that's Sheesh. Old. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. <laughs> Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. I'd have liked to go to college. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. Did get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and while it being your birthday and all, figure this is as good a time as any. I feel like I said, <laughs> I mean, after you, obviously. Really? No. Oh, I'm what's in. a sip gonna hurt? You are not drinking. That is that. I feel a little guilty taking the first. Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. And to the hope that we see them again. Someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep him warm. He's a tough little guy. I do not need to be encouraging sure? him to yeah. drink. 
Thank you. No problem. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just... don't know what she's getting at all this. She usually travels by herself. That has to be hard. Maybe she's just lonely. Well... That'd explain a few things. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. <laughs> it was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. Alright. Alright, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. It's my fault for bringing it up. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly <laughs> hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes. Yes. That, that is exactly it. Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. <laughs> both of you. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. I'd come back for you. You know what I mean. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Clem. I do the same. Luke's a regular Casanova. <laughs> hey, shut up. Don't be modest. <laughs> the moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Oh. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry. It's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. So old is Bonnie. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here. Maybe a swig of this will change their minds. 